Hi friends, Luke here from the Edible Schoolyard. Today we're gonna have our chicken check-in. So this is Temple, you might remember her from last week. You, might, you may have met her before. She's one of our more friendlier uh, chickens. She's very easy to handle. So she's really good on camera. So last week we talked about how chickens are omnivores, meaning they can eat plants, bugs, all sorts of things. Today we're gonna to talk about how it is, how they process that food. So, you know, humans, we have our stomachs and when we consume our food, we chomp it up in our mouth and then it goes down into our stomach where uh, our body breaks it down. Chickens are a little different. So, let's look closely at Temple's face. Now, when you look at her mouth, what do you notice? that's different about her mouth compared to mine. Any ideas? Any ideas? She doesn't have teeth. So, since she doesn't have teeth, her body has to get creative on how it's gonna break down all that grass that's really fibrous. So, Temple might be scratching around the garden. She'll eat some grass, swallow it, and swallow it. So at that point, the grass goes in something called the crop, which is a little sack on the right side of her neck. And that's where all the grass and all the little tasty bits are stored. Um, they're stored there because Temple, she's got a small body and she can't process all that food at one time. So that crop is there to, to store the food. And when she, her body's ready, food from that crop will go down into another part called the gizzard. Now the gizzard, it makes chickens and birds um, unique to a lot of other animals. So the gizzard is another sack. Um, it's got muscles all around it and it's filled up with grit. So that grit is, uh, they're small pebbles, uh, coarse sand, and so Temple, she, when she's foraging around the garden, she'll be eating those small pebbles and coarse sand, and it goes into her um, gizzard. So the food will go from her crop into the gizzard, and the gizzard churns it up with the pebbles and the sand, and it breaks it down, and then goes on to the rest of her body, uh, her stomach, where it's then further broken down. So in review, chickens are unique because they have a gizzard and a crop. So remember, they'll eat the food, goes into their crop, which is on their neck, and the food is stored there until their body is ready to further break it down. So the food then goes to the gizzard, which has sand and, and uh, coarse pebbles, and churns up all that food and acts as the chicken's teeth. So I hope you learned a little bit today about how chickens eat and how their body breaks down their food. Remember, next week we'll have another chicken check-in, and I look forward to talking to you then. Mm -hmm.